maybe, but it was one. It was it went game three. Oh, and was it? Was that game three? Yeah. Game three, that was a two stock, yeah. Oh, well, that's good. I'm glad it took a game. That makes it close. All right, lights out. Ace, um, the Sheik against Q-Tip, the Blue Falcon. Uh, yeah, Q-Tip's game plan, from what I've noticed in most matchups, is just kind of, I guess it's Falcon in general, just run around there. He looks like he's playing really well. He does a super oh, that was a stuff. that was a zero to death. Uh, yeah, we're gonna wait on winner final to the losers back up. Because once we have like losers final, so you can just like after losing semis, you can just look grab, no punish play, though, and then play and then play, you know, knock it out. Risky dash attack. Simple. Okay, punish. Racking up some pretty good percent off stage though against gets a sheik. Just wait a not something you want to be. Q-tip. Excuse me? What did he say? He said, Loki, I want you to win. Well, not Loki, I want you to win. I don't know what these scrub sheiks doing. Or I want Q-tip to win, actually, but. Gibby is not. He's actually really good. I don't good. care. They're sheiks. Are you, are you smoking? Smoking is bad for you, man. <laughs> <laughs> and, and the set's over. And the set's over. All right. Ooh, that was a neat moment. Okay, Q-Tip does not let chop me. Why? He doesn't. I don't think I've ever seen him let chop me. Like, I like, I land on stage against him, and I'm like, shit, like I'm dead, and he just goes for like a, like, a get-up attack instead of a let chop me, which I think is... It takes a little bit to get used to doing it. Well, it's pretty important, because this stock would be closed out if he went for a ledge hop knee instead of whatever he did go for. I know he likes to play a slower neutral game, so he needs to not sit there. Yeah, getting Shino she stalled is not. God. It's really easy to clean up stock. What? I want to sit here and yell at this guy. Huh? Kind of. I got music. Alright. All right, so it looks like the big thing about this match is that she can like get Falcon pretty easily off stage. I just don't really like when people talk as they play the set. But that's me. I think Tyler can win this. He's gonna play smart. She can try to force like hitboxes in his face and then get grabbed off. You know? He needs to, at this percent, you can get like upper knees pretty easily. He needs to focus on playing again. Trying to get solely one neutral. Ah, uh, sorry, if I had some bear life. That's a clean stock. I think he need to try and get out of ledge. He can convert off that. Oh, there it is. That was a good, good way to end it. Um, I think he's either going to try and go to a super small stage or maybe like a really, really big stage. Uh, Tyler. I think they're going to go Yoshi. It's very good for stuffing out Sheik. I mean, for stepping out Falcon. Ready? Two, two. It's... Well, there's probably a fan. Oh, he's going with the tech chase. You can actually... There's a lot of things to get out of that tech chase. I mean, that, like, they always have an option to cover it, but... It's like a Gamma Rock versus shoot, I feel like, in the tech chase, you can Falcon and shoot. Um, taking the neutral slow after getting that early 60% means you can't like crouch cancel or anything of sheets anymore. That was a clean edge guard by the sheep. He's doing really well at killing Walker off ledge. That's a bad spot, he might die for this. Ah, luckily he's good to get. I think if the Sheik had just grabbed one and then back aired, he would have been a lot more trouble. Ah, oh, 
Looks like he's gonna get the fuck anyways. Down smash is looking really far off. You can definitely win this game. Yeah, that's a good one. The get up attack pushes them off if they try and get the ledge too. And holds. I generally just like to roll and then react. But get up attack works too. He's trying to get reads on the roll in. But I think he needs to just take the confirmed percent off the tech chase. He's doing really nice knees though. Ooh, that's, that's how you catch it up. 54% lead for Sheik, that's not bad. Let's definitely come back to the last Pokemon. He needs to watch out for those big ass legs. How's it going? Ooh, what a combo. He almost, if he had converted off that, he would have got off hell hard. I think he needs to look for a grab and turn up their knee at 80%. That's a knee. Yep, there we go. Alright, he's still keeping that same percentage. He's not really getting any more behind. He just needs to watch the lock game and knock off the stage. There's a scary part of being on the platform is that she can wait and then just hit you off. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that was a nice grab. Gets the hug. Oh, he's gonna die for it though. He's gonna grab ledge. Where do you think he's gonna go? I don't know, Chris. I'm gonna talk to myself instead and I'm gonna be like, hey, I think he's gonna go Pokemon. I've got money on that. I know Tyler really likes this stage, but I think I think Pokemon would have been better. It's kind of like he said he was banning Fountain. It's tough to get back at this position. That's a good lead trick. Keisha's lead. I think the problem with being in Cheek here is that she doesn't really suffer from like having you live as long because she can just jump down and gimp you like that. Like Falcon, while he can go, it's only with people who can hit him high. But like people like Sheik who are gonna kill you off the side almost every time, like Good. He needs to get this game back to control with an arse dog like pretty fast. He's looking for these knees a little too hard I think. He could he could have just taken another up air, gone stage control, and then gone for the get up knee on the recover. Uh clean edge guard I guess. She has pretty good control. It seems like if it keeps up like this, I was just not getting enough punishes. So I think it's not going to go his way if he can't get a kill. There's a nice car jumping into the back air. I use it twice, but hey, it hit him. Punishing down, so that's just a pain in the ass because that's so many active frames. And that's a little none and lag. So she's doing a really good job. Just staying grounded against Falcon. Alright, got one. I guess he can come back, but it's gonna be really tough. Alright. Oh, I think. 
Just playing nice and patiently, catching the walls. I think that's a trait a lot of old school players have. They're a little more patient than new, newer players because they just don't have all the same tech options. I think that's game. Alright.